Basketball has taken Wabash Valley native Sarah Dickey a lot of places, including foreign countries. She was overseas when this coronavirus pandemic started. She's back in the United States and the Wabash Valley now with her family, but she recently talked to Sports 10 about everything she experienced. Former Riverton Park and University of Evansville basketball star Sarah Dickey has seen the coronavirus crisis up close the last few weeks in both Europe and Australia. The flight from Qatar to Perth arrived a few hours before um, the mandated 14-day self-quarantine, which carried a $55,000 fine if violated, um, so I was lucky to get in right before that. Um, but there was a confirmed case on my flight, but it was on a completely different section of the plane. Dickey was looking forward this year to playing in her fourth season of professional basketball overseas and her first in Australia. But like all other sports, the coronavirus stopped it. Right there, we were still hopeful that the season was going to continue as scheduled. Um, but then after a day, it was postponed, and then the next day, um, the league decided to continue the season without foreign players. Um, so I was no longer eligible and they had to send me home. Before heading back to the Wabash Valley, Dickie did get to experience something in Australia she'd never get to do here. I still got a surfing lesson from my Australian roommate. Um, and I was well taken care of by my team. Like so many athletes, Dickie's playing career is on hold but she plans to go back overseas again next year. She's excelled playing pro ball. She's earned several honors while averaging just under 16 points per game in her young career. I'm still having a blast playing overseas um, because I have had a lot of awesome teammates from all over the world and I've learned so much. Um, it's just always an adventure and I wouldn't trade my experiences for anything.